Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're taking a look at the Just Survive Test Server update notes for February the 13th. If you're new to the channel or a frequent visitor, be sure you guys click on that watermark in the bottom right hand corner to subscribe. The weapon cleaning kit was removed along with lower gun tiers. We can of course make cleaning kits, so it makes sense that the team wanted to encourage us to make our own. We'll now have an upgrade system that allows players to build the higher tier weapons, which in my opinion is a lot more viable and engaging for players. Lower armor tiers were removed and like the weapon cleaning kit, you'll still be able to make the plated armor while still finding the rare Kevlar vest. Helmets have been returned to their mitigation, so they'll prevent the same amount of damage as they used to. Container hit points have been reduced and we are now limited to just 20 containers per foundation. So if you want more storage, you'll need to make additional foundations. The team fixed an issue that was preventing players from being able to add permissions to additional foundations that are added to the main foundation. Stone walls have been fixed so that holes won't appear if you're playing on lower levels of graphic details. Zombie spawns have been adjusted. Apparently there were too many. I'm going to assume that the rate was adjusted for when two or more players are next to each other. Punchy sticks that can be placed in the sky were corrected. Can't say I saw any up there, but it's been fixed. Sleeping mats are now working again. There was a bit of an issue that was keeping us from being able to use them. You can always build a camping cot, but you may not necessarily want to carry a bunch of them around with you. Improvements to navigating slope terrain was improved. You'll still get a little character grunt and cries of pain from certain falls or running into something, but it's a little bit more manageable now. There were a number of other miscellaneous fixes and corrections. If you want to see all the specific details that I didn't cover in this video, you can click on the update note link in the published section below. And that's going to wrap it up for this look at the test server update notes for February 13th, a bit of a short one. Thank you guys for all the likes, shares, and comments. Your participation on the channel is always appreciated. If you haven't already, you can now click on the channel icon you see appearing on the screen to subscribe. Then click on the notification bell so you'll be alerted when the next videos are uploaded. That way, you'll have all the latest out of Daybreak and Just Survive.